So I went on this road trip with this guy to New York. It was supposed to be a double date type of thing. I told you about this. Mm, I, I'm trying to remember. I think I told you about this. <laughs> I went on this double date to New York. And I had paid for the hotel for me and my homegirl. And she was going to pay me half. I paid for the hotel for me and her. And I paid for the wax museum tickets for mm-hmm. me and her. She ended up just sticking with her date and not showing. So, of course, me and him went to the hotel and to the, the wax museum. So, pretty much, I paid for everything. He didn't give me half for nothing. He didn't give me money. So, she didn't even go She didn't even go. She, she uh, did go to New York. Oh, she just didn't She just didn't meet up with me. Yeah. So, he paid so, for the trip. Yeah, shit. like, okay. the story is a long, drawn story. If I was to give y'all full-blown details, y'all be like, what the fuck? So, she, we just never met up. Mm-hmm. Some shit happened in the mist. We never met up with them. She was in New York with her date. I was in New York with with him. The only reason why I even went with him is for her to get back with her date. She was trying to get back in good with her person. Okay. So I was trying to be take one for the team, so to say. Mm-hmm. So he didn't give me no money for nothing. He didn't give me no money for the hotel. He didn't give me no money for the tickets. And then he was like, let's go to the polo store. And I was like, all right, bet. Let's go to the polo store. So we go to the polo store and I call my sons and I ask my sons if they wanted anything from the polo store. They was like, yeah, get us this, 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 and this. So I got my sons a couple of t-shirts and sweaters or whatever. It was a sale going on. So I didn't blow money like I was balling I don't or know anything. Where this is going. I think I spent like $120 for my sons for their t-shirts and sweaters. Everything was on sale. Mm-hmm. So we get back to the hotel and he was like, um, you think, uh, you think I can get those tags? I said, excuse me, what? He said, you you think I can get those tags off them sweaters? Because then I can, like, take them and, and exchange them for something. You know what I do. Because pretty much he steals, but he steals with the tags. He'll go and return for that price ticket so oh, he can get the stuff and flipped it. and get some more shit. For that price ticket. So the sweaters were priced at $110 a piece. But because they were on sale, I didn't pay that amount. Right. So I was like, um, no. What if my sons want to return or exchange it because they can't fit it? Did you know this guy before? No, not really. So it was like the other guy's friend? It was the other guy's friend. I had went to this, I had went to this pajama party. I didn't even know it was a pajama party. It was a whole bunch of guys there. I introduced to a few of them. They was like, oh, no, he's going to be a better fit for you versus him. And actually, the guy whose house it was is the guy that I was trying to talk to. Mm -hmm. But they were like, no, he's a dog. So I'm sitting here listening to these motherfuckers like, no, he's a dog. He ain't shit. His girl live here. Because none of them are shit. Yeah. So pretty much he wanted me to hook up with his broke friend and lift his broke friend up is what one what he wanted me to do his friend is broke and lived in the basement mm-hmm. he was like running out he of basement out. he wanted him to link up with me and not so mess with the in. nigga that actually had the fucking money uh i was like what the fuck who what kind of fucking friend he and but when i told him that the guy that i had I'm looking went to, out for my boy i'm looking out for my boy when i had went to new york with the dude he was trying to get in the bed with me i said um excuse me what because he we went out to dinner he looked at the fucking ticket. He said, yeah, I got tomorrow. It slid it back in front of me. I said, what the fuck? Oh, no. What the fuck? So, so one, no, no, you, didn't, no, no, you didn't help no. me pay for the hotel that you stayed in. You didn't help me pay for the uh, uh, wax museum tickets. You didn't pay for your portion of the dinner. When did this become a date that I paid for everything? Like, you wasn't even supposed to be here, my guy. Like, you were supposed to have been with your homeboy, and my homegirl was supposed to be here to pay half, and I ended up having to pay for the whole fucking thing out I'm my pocket. I'm going to tell you why I couldn't come up with a bad date story. Because you wouldn't allow that bullshit. Exactly. So, I got more. <laughs> so, anyway. <laughs>